To begin, change your font to Times New Roman and its size to 12. Click the Paragraph Options button to open up its pop-up. Set the line spacing option to double. You'll also want to remove the after spacing by setting it to zero. Click OK. Now double click at the top of your page to edit the header. Click on the Different from First Page checkbox. In your header type, running head with a colon and then type the title of your paper in all capital letters. Then hit the tab key to go to the right side of your document, which is where we'll put our page number. Go to the Insert tab. Click on the Page Number drop down button and hover over Current Position. Select the first option. We're done in the header, so double click outside of it to deselect it. Now click on the Home tab. Select the Center Alignment button. Then hit Enter eight times until you are about at the center of your page and then type the title of your paper. Then type your name, then your college, then hit the Enter key until you are down to the next page. In the header on your next page, type the title of your paper in all capital letters. Hit the Tab key until it's on the right side of your paper. And we're going to add a page number here, just like we did before, so click on the Page Number drop down button, Current Position, and select the first option. Double click out of the header and then type the title of your paper. Hit the Enter key. Next, let's go back to the Home tab and click Left Align. Press the Tab key and then go ahead and start typing your paper. Be sure to press Tab before each new paragraph. Once you are done writing your paper, press the Enter key until you are on a new page. Then go back to the Home tab and click the Center Align button. Type References and press Enter. Make sure you are in the Home tab and then hit the Left Align button. Click on the Paragraph Options button. In the special drop down box, select the Hanging option. Then click OK. Now I'm just going to paste my references in. If yours don't indent automatically, just hit Tab after each new line to set up your hanging indent. Alright, and that's all there is to it. I hope you found this tutorial useful.